Earlier this month, Prince Harry's trip from California to London was marked by an air of melancholy as he attended his uncle Lord Robert Fellow's funeral. The somber occasion, however, did little to mend the fractured relationship between Harry and his brother, Prince William. According to sources close to the scene, the brothers remained distinctly apart throughout the event, deepening the already palpable rift. As the funeral unfolded, it was disheartening for many to witness the royal brothers' apparent estrangement in such a poignant setting. The brothers didn't exchange a single word or even a glance, opting instead to keep their distance. Observers noted that they were seated two or three rows back from the front, strategically placed on opposite sides of the aisle, with a buffer of family members between them. This arrangement appeared almost deliberate, underscoring the ongoing tension that has plagued their relationship. Adding to the drama, it was reported that both Harry and William arrived at the church just before the service began, managing to slip in through separate back doors. This solitary entrance further emphasized the fractured relationship, leaving onlookers to speculate about the current state of their bond. In a surprising twist, rumors began circulating that Harry left three gifts for William's children after the funeral. Lady C, a notable figure in the royal gossip sphere, described Harry's gesture as a cynical attempt to use the children to mend fences with their parents. According to her, the gift seemed to be a strategic move rather than a heartfelt gesture, aimed at softening the icy reception he received from the Wales family. Lady C's sentiments were echoed by many, who criticized Harry's attempts to reconcile through what they perceived as manipulative tactics. Some speculated that William may have dismissed the gifts outright, potentially even discarding them if they were suspected of containing bugging devices. Given the historical context of privacy invasions and scandalous rumors, the suggestion that Harry might have left the gifts with someone less connected to William, such as his uncle, only fueled speculation about the nature of the items. Adding to the intrigue, some observers raised concerns about the true intentions behind the gifts. There were insinuations that the items could have been a vehicle for hidden agendas, reflecting a deeply unsettling aspect of Harry's approach. Critics argued that, given Harry and Meghan's track record, the gesture was more about intrusion and manipulation than genuine reconciliation. The idea that Harry's gifts might be passed on to the Wales children, who have been the subjects of so much public scrutiny and controversy, was met with suspicion and disapproval. In the face of such accusations, it was noted that the Wales children might be better off without these gifts. The controversy surrounding Harry and Meghan's public actions, including their previous behavior and statements, has led many to believe that any attempt at outreach might be tainted by the history of conflict with the royal family. Some have even suggested that the gifts might have been subjected to forensic examination for hidden recording devices, reflecting a deep-seated mistrust. Neil Sean, a prominent commentator on royal affairs, reported that Harry's gifts were accompanied by a personal handwritten letter to William. However, Sean was uncertain whether the gifts were ever given to the children, or if William had read the letter. This ambiguity only adds to the speculation surrounding the gesture and the ongoing tension between the brothers.